this individual, I got a question for you. With this individual doing this, do you think this is first time, maybe doing this, but do you think this is first time having some type of dealings where he had to go to the front office? Do you think they don't have a, a little probably jacket not. on this guy? Probably uh, not. Oh, probably not. He's, it's, a, it's not a first time offense. I know that. It's rich reaction time. Hey, let's hey. do it. Mm, I'm ready. I'm ready. Mm. Let's see what you got there, because you know I'm always, I'm always ready for what you got. <laughs> that, that CB, them crimson Alabama. brothers. Okay, <laughs> for sure. What is this at? Florida team beats a no contest. Mm. They done broke it up now. Ah, well, we'll stop right there. Let's stop right there. So, nephew, nephew. It looks like there's that, that, that was a, a school environment right there. And it looks like one of the black teenagers beat up on a a, a white uh, teacher or administration, whomever, right? He just ran up on her and started beating her. So you didn't see anything that led up to that. So I'm thinking like, okay, well, what's the reasoning behind him reacting? There had to be something prior to that. That's yes. One. That's one. It had to be something prior to that. And it's probably just talk. And why do we react to talk? Because talk is just talk. You know, if she came and start beating him across the head and then he's reacting, that's different. But if it's just talk, it's a freedom of speech. So anybody can just talk. So you shouldn't be, uh, you know, uh, riled up because of somebody just talking. That's, just, that's dumb. That's dumb. That's, I mean, you're small minded to me. But I, I, I feel like that particular instance and that reaction to uh, to the little uh, teenager that's being known. I mean, yeah. What's the reason behind it? I need some more info. You, have you have you seen this video before? Look, I've I've seen um, that, and uh, it was saying something about uh, she took the Nintendo Switch. Away from him in class. Oh, and his other, his other, uh, other report said that it didn't even take the Nintendo Switch in class. So now, why does he have a Nintendo Switch in class? Okay. Well, look, let me say it's this: not a part of the curriculum, is it? No, any. <laughs> yeah, that's absolutely the case. This is a 17-year-old we're talking about, who's about six foot six and about 270 pounds. And uh, deputies say that when the teachers aid. He okay. literally set her flying through the air. Go ahead, go with Deputy King. Look, look at me. You gonna be cool with Deputy King and I? I don't want to go to jail. Flagler deputies slapping the handcuffs on the teenager because of his age. We're not showing his face or sharing his name. He's charged with knocking a teacher's aide unconscious after deputies say she took away his Nintendo Switch video game. I'm telling him that he couldn't do it. She left the classroom. Uh, he chased after her into the hallway and then very violently uh, pushed her to the ground so hard that uh, he completely mess. Her unconscious. The sheriff's office report states that his push made her go flying before she hit the floor, and that's when the beating started. And then started kicking this teacher. Uh, well, we got it. Mess. Can we cut it? Yeah, yeah, cut it. We, can, we, can we cut already it. know that that's a mess. That's a mess. But look, look, look. The, the, the student is trying to get his little property back and he brought some game system into school that wasn't part of curriculum nintendo right. switch is not a part of the curriculum they okay. didn't say bring your nintendo switch tomorrow because we're going to be doing x y and z no so okay. he got mad he got mad he got mm -hmm. upset they took it from him or whatever and and now actually you know you're going to get it back because it's not their property but in his mind, 
I'm never getting it back, and I'm gonna re- react to that. And that's why he beat the woman unconscious. You know he's going to juvenile, and he's gonna be charged. You know, as that. he should. Look, look, yes. couple of things, couple of things, couple of things on that. Okay, look, back in the day, little older guys or whatever. If you remember the Game Boy when it yeah. came out, mm-hmm. people might bring it to school and everything. But I can tell you this, and we did those things. I couldn't afford it back in the day. We couldn't afford it. But if a teacher took that away, nobody would go and fight the teacher, hit the teacher. Threaten the teacher. This day and time, these the kids are out of control. Do and you think? Uh, do you think the father was involved in this? Do you think the father is involved in this? This uh, we both thinking fight? the same thing. I'm just saying. Do you I'm just, think? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Kane, thank you for asking that question, and I don't want to agree with you. You know, I don't. <laughs> I like to go against you. Like hey, you I'm like just asking. You. I'm just asking. I'm like, do, do you, you think, think that young man? Well, he's he's part of a single mom that's Thank trying you. to be the mom and the daddy but you can only be the mama that's all you can be that's all you can be don't even act like you can be the daddy when father's day come around you're not it okay yeah. no six foot seven six foot yeah. if they, boy six, six foot, foot whatever one, it six doesn't matter seven. doesn't matter he, he beating up somebody because he didn't he, he got his property taken from him because he brought it to school and you know that wasn't on the curriculum he knew that. Yeah, that would be no different if it was a cell phone. You know that's not part of the curriculum. We know that, but we yeah. we do things when we're kids and I'm and, and teenagers. So I'm not talking about the beating. Don't want you to think that. But bringing a game, bringing something new to school. Uh, when CD players came out, did we bring them to school? Yes, man. I want you to see this. I'm we down. snuck them in though. We snuck them in. Mm-hmm. Just like if he you get did. caught. If you get caught, then, okay, I got caught. That's how he got caught. You ain't, gonna, you ain't gonna beat down the teacher because you got caught. No, you got you're caught. Not. You got caught. That's all it is. And they Damn take you. it and you get it back at the end of the day or whatever. But being emotional, we don't know if it's a man president in our house. But I think it's What's not. That? I know you do too because we wouldn't allow. You're not gonna go to that school. And, and touch, disrespect adults. And I say this right here, everybody, congregation, family, I'm big on kids, children, respecting adults from the old school. We said, yes, sir, no, sir. I knew that before I was in the military. It's yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. We, we getting out of that because we talk to our kids now like they are our little brother. Our little sister, yep. we 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 yep. have to get out of that. So he was he was wrong a hundred percent. Should he go to whatever facility? Yes, I believe that a hundred percent. Did they yes. say it was? And people uh, say maybe uh, he might have had mental problems or whatever. I don't know if that's the case or not. He still need to go. He still need to go. He still need counseling. That's how I feel. I, I feel like he still need to go no matter what because he don't have anything stable at home. So we need to get somebody in his life. And if yes. it needs to be the mental health department or whatever, we need to get somebody in his life because he didn't have it stable at home. He may be, you know, single mom or whatever, dad locked up or not around or whatever the case may be. That may be the circumstances. However, sending them back home, what is that going to do? What is it going to help him out? Nothing. No, nothing. Nothing. He's going to he going to beat the next teacher that take his cell phone or that take something else or whatever, right? So no, no. I, and I, I'm on I'm on the side of the school board. Let's let's go ahead and put him, you know, uh uh in juvenile. You know, he he acted out because his parents couldn't um straighten him out. So he acted out and we got to go ahead and do it. Kane, but with this individual, I got a question for you. With this individual doing this, do you think this is first time maybe doing this? But do you think this is first time having some type of dealings where he had to go to the front office? Do you think they don't have a a little probably jacket not. on this guy? Probably, probably not. Oh, probably not. He's it's, a, it's not a first time offense. I know that. 
I know it's not a first time offense. However, they've been sweeping a lot of things under the rug and nobody's been getting to the foundation. The foundation is family. And I've been saying that for the longest foundation is family. If he don't have family, he don't have anybody in his family that can kind of keep him and guide him in the right direction. So he's going to be acting out and he has to suffer some consequences. No matter, you know, he may have not had a family and his parents may have failed him, but he still has to take the consequences no matter what. And and I will go. It's not right, but it's 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 honesty. I, I and I believe what you're saying. And this is where I go with ladies, gentlemen. If we we not married and we out of the, the household, we have to do better as parents. And that goes with all races, where even if we're not getting along. We still need to have the best interest of the kids. We 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 have to have the best interest of the kids. I don't care if you talking to another individual or if he's talking to another individual. If we're done, we're done. But the betterment of our kids for the community, and that's all races, because it's bigger. Once we introduce our kids, your seed, our seed into this world. It's got to be about the kids. We can't hold these petty, petty grudges anymore. So we, and that's all nationalities. I'm not just saying black. No, we have to do better by the kids because we can't let that right there happen. Yeah. That well, right it, there can't it, it, happen. I think it happened because it was a buildup of anger and anger is what motivated. Where did he get the anger? Uh, I, I, you may not want to hear this. Just so go I'm ahead. The truth. But where he gets the anger is from his mama. OK, so the reason why I say that he's like, oh, OK, Kane. all right, you say it's from the mama. Why do you say it's from the mama? It's mm -hmm. because it's because of. Um, Whenever you in a single parent household and the mama's in charge, she is always angry about something. And those particular instances that that go on throughout your childhood, you you, you tend to emulate them when you get older. So that, he's acting out. He's acting out on all those different things that he's uh, seen throughout his childhood. So the reason why he lashed out at that teacher is because mm -hmm. he's seen his mama lash out at him mm. or lash out at his daddy or lash out at his brother or sister or whatever, right? Yes. So it's emulating what they see. People don't want to say this, but that's what it is. Now, do you say uh, women are the root of all evil? It's the spirit in them. It's the spirit in them. They have no control over it. They have to go with the forgiveness, and this is this is going to the religious side that I know you like to go, but yeah. it's 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 in them. So since it's in them, because Adam and Eve and all of that, the fruit and all of that stuff, that's the reason why all that happens. So you got to make sure that you know uh, you you are uh, making making sure that the um, actual. Um, you know the the child and the mother and all of that. They, they, it has to all be in line because if it's not in line, then it's like messed up. And you see what happens when it's not all all, all in line. And well, if you don't have the father in there, is the father? I don't care what the reason is. Is if if it's because he ran away, if she pushed him away, if whatever, if he's locked up in jail or whatever, or if he's dead, whatever that reason may be. He needs to be that that particular uh, uh, student needs to have some type of male role model in their in their life. OK, that's key. You saying a uh, key role model, uh, male role yeah. model. But and when I, I say, I say when I say role model, I'm just saying that somebody that that's in their family that can, you know, push them forward in the right way. That's right. what I'm saying, role model. I'm not saying you need to emulate everything that particular person because no. people look at role models like I need to emulate everything. You 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 don't need to emulate everything, but they just need to uh, be 
that particular person. Go ahead, go ahead. I, I gotta say go ten ahead, three. Nephew. That means standby. <laughs> okay. Go ahead, nephew. But uh, yeah, I don't want to get too far off in the road, mod. I know we have. We're gonna say that for you, and we're gonna cook on that too. Mm -hmm. But uh, you 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 had uh said a couple of things. Um, one thing I don't I don't want to I don't want to uh say is that I'm I'm blaming the women the single woman or whatever. I, I don't want to. I don't want to. Not 100%. No way. No, because... Why look, not? Listen for one second. I didn't... I let Why you not? Cook. I let you cook. Let me let me try to cook. Okay. Let me put a little grease in the pan. I'm listening, nephew. Let, let me put a little grease in the pan. Because look, it takes two of us. It takes two of us to, to make these kids, okay? Whatever but happens... We only got one. We're just talking about single one. The one that only has her own, you know, she's a single mom. She maybe have two or three kids, whatever, but it's her. Well, well okay. I, I'm not concerned with no two Even or three if the kids guy right is now. not in the picture. Yes, but let, let me expound on that. Let me expound yeah. on that because when we come together and a kid can be produced or whatever, whether you like me or not, I like you or not, whether we're young or not, now it's about the kid. And in my day and time, and it's happening today, it's kids having kids. So now the grandparents are going to have to get involved in it too. Okay, that's just the truth of the whole matter. Okay, but when we come together and the kid is growing up, now I don't I don't want to deal with him. I won't I don't want him seeing a kid because now he's talking to whatever whatever her name is no now it's about the kid don't not allow your 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 son your daughter to be with their father because look whatever y'all say this independent woman thing all of that stuff kids need their father because it's just a I different agree. type of parental guidance and men i would say this about us we have to be involved in their lives. I don't care if she's talking to somebody else. I don't care if she done had a baby by somebody else. But you have your kid. What Ladies, does the father bring to the table? What does the father bring to the table? The father brings the peace. The father brings the uh, logical sense to the situation. Yes. The woman brings the emotional side of the situation. So... When it's emotional, you see how they act and react, right? So you see how he acted in that sense. He took my Nintendo Switch, so I need to react to it, right? But a logical man would be like, okay, you took my Nintendo Switch. I did something wrong. What I need to do to get it back? That's the logical thing. But the emotional side is, you took my Nintendo Switch. That's not yours. That's not yours. You you didn't pay for that. My mama paid for that, or my daddy paid for that, or whatever. You know, you know, like. You're going into the emotional state. But, Kane, we could both agree. We could both crucial. agree. You're right. And we could both agree that it appears, and we don't know, people. We don't know, family, congregation, if the father was there. But if the father was active in their life, that kid wouldn't have thought of doing something like that because he would face some consequences. I agree. He would be brought up. No, not my kid. I My agree. kid meets Cain, regardless of his age. He's going to say yes, sir, no, sir. Because that's how I was brought up. Regardless if I was there in my son's life the whole time, he's going to say yes, sir, no, sir, yes, ma'am, no, sir, no, no ma'am. And that's what fathers can bring those things. And okay? but at, at the same time, you got to make sure that the child knows the reasoning behind it. Not so much you just say, oh. I was brought up that way. That that's not a, a explanation, but you saying that's out of respect. Yep. You explain respect. that it's out of respect. If you explain it is out of respect, then you know that that's what needs to be done. So they know the reasoning behind what they're saying or whatever. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. So I, I like like you know my my I would say my final thoughts with that is where is the father in this situation? Was the father in the life? 
Um, and we may not know all, you know, the ins and outs or whatever, but I feel like from my perspective, this is Kane's perspective, though. So my perspective is, you know, he lashed out because he just emulated what his mother did. And he he's seen what his mother did, and that's why he lashed out because of his video game system, and that's the reason why he did that. You can say your final thoughts on that, but uh, I, I just I feel like that. it came from the mama. You can say it came from not having both, but I just say it just came from the mama because that's what he has. I don't care yeah. about what he don't have. I'm caring about what he's in front of. Okay, uh, I you know I always I'm I'm a big advocate of not just blaming the the lady. I'm not going to say that's what he's seen from his mama. I'm not going to say that. I know that kid is hurt, but I'm, it's definitely not an excuse. I don't know whether he mad with his life. Okay. That is a pride possession for him, but I'm not putting it on the mama. No way. I'm not. Now, you going to put it on him? I'm putting it on his surroundings and him. Yes. You're gonna blame That's him. What I'm putting it on. We're talking yes. about a child. We're not talking about yes, an adult. Yes, I'm talking about a child. Yes. So it's on. It's his 17, fault. Yeah. It, his surroundings. Who put him in his surroundings? I, his mama, his daddy. The family is involved in his surroundings. The correct? both, both parties, both parties. The father. I don't know. We're not just gonna say. We're not gonna say unless he's dead or whatever. Not gonna say just jail. Whatever situation, his mom and dad put him in that situation. People, I want to know in the comments if you agree. You don't have to agree with me, but I'm not just going to, I don't I don't take the narrative of always saying the single moms are um, the cause for the fall of the black community. I can't subscribe to that because um, we play a part well, too. Well, we play a part well, too. And I'm not just a, a ladies advocate hey, by no means. Hey. But they I can't, they can't emulate something be. that's not there. Yes. So if the guy, if the father is not there, they can't emulate that, right? They emulate what's in front right. of them, right? Right, 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 right. All right. So you gotta you gotta look at it like that. So you gotta look at it like, okay, so the mother is the one that comes in the house. Did y'all clean up? Who didn't do this? Who didn't do that? Blah 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 blah. You know, like yeah. that's that, that that's but that anger, that's that all of that. So he like probably hasn't seen his mom's attacking nobody and trying to kick him to sleep and all of that stuff. That's a lot of anger. That's a lot of hurt for a six foot seven man, young man in a man's body. Just Do he need to? He needs to Same. go to the juvenile facility and pay for his action. He needs treatment. He needs therapy. We both. I feel as though he knew. He do. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. He don't need to go and, back to his mama. He definitely don't need, they don't need to slap him on the wrist and say, go back to your mama, because the mama is the one that gave him that anger. And his mom can't go on that on camera, which we see in the in the community. Oh, he's not like that. He's such a good kid. Mom, let's tell the truth. What's going on mm -hmm. in the house? Yeah. Is he seeing multiple yep. people yep. running yep. through yep. there? Yep. Yep. So like, like I say, man, like, look. I'm just saying, like, he gets all that anger. He doesn't get it from his daddy. Yeah. If if his dad is not around, he's not getting it from his daddy. You know, you know, he's not getting it. He's getting it from his mama because yeah. she's around, and yeah. she's the one. She may be, you know, acting out to her best ability. I get it. I get it. This is all she got. She has so much stuff against her. I get it. I get it. But just say, hey, it's me. Throw your hands up and be like, it's me. I'm the reason why my kid is acting the way that they're acting, not pointing the fingers. Everybody wants to point the fingers at the father or whatever. Even the father is not in it, but you have them in your space. So mm -hmm. if, if they're not performing like they should be performing, then it's on you. And that's the thing. So, okay. so let, final and, thoughts. And, 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 and if there's anything else you want to add to, but I mean, we can close this out if we're, you want to. We're going to close it out. We're going to close it out. But I, I, this is not for you to answer, people. Uh, uh, but y'all can answer this question in the comments. I just want you to think on it. Marinate, barbecue, and mildew. We know. Shout out <laughs> E40. But uh, can ladies raise a man 
Think about it. Think about it. That's what Karen says. No. I'm out. All right. We out. Take it easy. All right. Thank <laughs> you.